Here I'm going to explain the differences between the AutoCAD object snap tracking and the tracking tools. Okay, so let's begin right here at the top. Here I'm going to use the object snap tracking to draw a line that is five units from the corner of this box here. This is a 10 by 10 box to give you some sort of a uh, uh, reference in size here okay now historically I would draw a line here and come out you know five units and then begin drawing my line upward that that's the idea that I want and then come back and erase this line okay well we we want to avoid that here so the, the using the line command I'm gonna come over here and uh, draw and hover over this point and then draw my line beginning at this point here However, to do this, you got to make sure of some settings here. Number one, you got to make sure your object snap tracking is on. Okay, and my object snap tracking is on. That's this button down here as well. Okay, and I have object uh, object snap tracking is on. Object snap is on. I've got my endpoint on, and then I've got the extension on. The extension is what's driving this. So I'm gonna click OK. Okay, I'm gonna start the line command, and I'm gonna start a line, and I'm gonna hover. Notice I say right there, hover, don't click. I'm going to hover over this point and then I'm going to move off in the direction that I want to go. That line that is there is an extension. That's why we have to have that extension on in the object snap uh, in the object tracking settings. Um, that extension from that point and I'm going to type in five and hit enter and then I'm going to start drawing my line upward. Therefore, I don't have to draw that construction line. Okay, it doesn't just work with lines. I mean, I could use a circle as well. So I want to do a circle, hover over this point, touch it, and it leaves that that line there. Five enter, and I can start drawing my circle in which the center point is in line with that corner. Okay, so that's the object snap tracking. Now let's move down here, in which here I need to draw a line that is five units to the right and three units down. Again, I don't want to draw using the, the, my construction lines. So here I'm going to start the line command and before I do anything else I'm going to start uh, I'm going to type in TK and hit enter. Okay and that enters me into a tracking mode in which I can click on this point and now I'm actually I, I'm going to draw if you, if you consider this I'm drawing construction lines without actually drawing the lines. So I clicked on that and notice that there it, I'm going in the direction I want to go and I type in 5 and hit enter and then come down three and hit enter and then enter again to get out of object uh, the tracking and then I can start drawing my line as well okay so the tracking command and the object snap tracking are a little bit different but they you know it, it eliminates us having to use all those construction lines hope this helps